Hello and welcome to Flowtots. In this tutorial, we're gonna be creating this Space Stars background inside of After Effects. So the first thing you're gonna do, you go to your project right here, right click and create new composition. Let's name this main and keep everything else as it is. Then we're gonna click OK. The next thing we're gonna do, we have to create a new solid. So to go to your timeline, right click, new and solid. Keep everything as it is. Don't change the color or do whatever you want because that doesn't matter. Just click OK. Then go to your effects and presets panel right here. If you can see this, go to window and you can see there effects and presets. Search for fractal noise and drag that effect to your solid. This will create this cloudy effect right here, as you can see, but this is not what you want to come for. So the first thing we're going to do to achieve the stars, we have to change some settings right here. First thing is to change the fractal type from basic to small bounce. And this will change the fractal type to these small squares, as you can see here, if you zoom in. And, but this is still not the effect that we're looking for. To achieve the stars, we have to play with the contrast and brightness. So the first thing we're going to change is the contra contrast from 100 to 165. And this would get rid of most of the effect right here and introduce black gaps in between. And then we're going to change the brightness to minus 50. And this now looks like ashes. And that's also not what we're looking here for. We are looking for stars. And to fix that, we go to transform right here and we're gonna change the scale from 100 to pi now we are looking at the stars so this now looks like repetitive right here because everything is small stars and big stars right here and what we're looking for is to introduce like black gaps in between the stars and to do that we're gonna go to sub settings right here and we're gonna change the sub scaling to 600 and that will introduce these black gaps right here and it looks random then you can go to sub influence here and play with these settings if you want more capping right here or if you want more stars we're gonna keep that the same and the next thing you're gonna do is to animate this and to do that we're gonna go to evolution and we're gonna create a keyframe we're gonna go two seconds later and we're gonna make this going around and now your stars are animated but as you can see when it goes to the end and to loop it doesn't loop it just cut the cut here and it starts again and to make it loop you have to go to evolution options right here and we're gonna check the box right here that says cycle evolution and what this does now when you play your animation it's gonna be looping forever so now you can just like add a new text like so or whatever your object that you want on top of your stars and there you go so that's it for this tutorial make sure to like and subscribe for more tutorials like this and you can also download the project file from my patreon for only one dollar and as always find what makes you happy and make that your life peace